Okay, you can see in here a little bit. That's all tobacco. That is wildwood flowering tobacco. And then I put them in these. It's, this is just a container like you would get some sort of bakery, something or another from a store. And then I cut it in two, put holes in the bottom. And I've been putting like six or three, I mean, three in a row, three in a row. So I get nine in there. These here. I already had done if you can see and now I'm having to put I'm having to transplant these into actual containers like this one which is just a mushroom container and then here is a red solo cup but so far that's what I've been doing and I'll show you some more if you can see back in there I've got more that has to be transplanted out okay and then here's some seed that we finally got replanted um, like this one is the Virginia tobacco um, and you see how we do it we just put plastic wrap on there but you have to keep them wet this is Cuban cigar I'll see if I can open these up in a minute and show you but um, then back here we've got like that's gold seal they don't look so hot but they are still growing um, then over that way Let's see, what is this one? Gold seal, gold seal. I'm trying to get them to. There's another gold seal back there, if you can see it. Okay, right there's our biggest gold seal. Now that is smoking tobacco. Then we've got um, right here, this is a perfume mix flowering tobacco. This one is a flowering perfume mix. Then here's a wildwood. Okay. And these I've got to transplant. Okay, here is some Cuban cigar. If you see that speck there, that's a speck of tobacco. So it is tiny. And then, you know, you keep spraying it daily. I spray this every single night. Every night. First time we did that one, it didn't germinate. Exactly. And I'm hoping and hoping, and I do have them on a heating heating pad. So I'm trying real hard with these to get them to actually do something this time. And right here. Oh wow. Okay, this is our Havana. Wow. You can see the that. Sprouts. Yeah, this one's going a lot quicker than our um, Cuban cigar. We got that in a trade. Yeah. So, <coughs> I have to spray them though daily. And I think I'm going to have to spray that Cuban a couple times a day because it looks a little bit drier than that Havana. Let's see this one. I may have to do the Virginia the same way because we had no no sprouts in the Virginia. Okay, we've got it. You see? And that is the Virginia. That's Virginia. That's Virginia gold. Gold. Oh, this is Virginia gold. Yeah. But you see, we've got a couple there. We also there. got that in a trade. Yeah. Same got same person we got uh -huh. the Havana from. Yeah. And um, the Virginia didn't sprout last time we no, saw it. No. Where did we get it? It's from seeds for the. Oh, okay. Well, I'm just going to spray it a little more and the Cuban because they're a lot slower. Maybe they need more moisture because they are on a heating pad, as you can see. Okay, for the most part, these are looking pretty good. And um, these are wildwood. I think they all are wildwood. Yeah, they are. Back there, we've got a couple that look a little puny, but for the most part, look pretty good. Okay, and here's some more. This one here is um, flowering perfume mix. Look at the size of that thing. It's grown. We've got some gold seals. Here's a nice gold seal. And we've got a bunch of little ones. Hey, look at this tobacco. Now, um, this is the wild wood. And this is not smoking tobacco. You don't smoke this. Oh, I want to show you the size of that one. Look at that. Um, 
This one, you know, smells good, good for flowering. We do have some of the type, you know, smoking tobacco, but this is just for the flowers and, you know, pollinators and such. But they're beautiful plants, and I just wanted to come in here and show you. Those back there, once they get bigger in that contain in those containers, if I can get in here, those will have to come out and go into their own cups or whatnot. Uh, some of these, like say this one and this one, you know, they they've got a while to go in these little cups, then they'll have to go into a bigger cup and eventually into pots and then eventually into the ground. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll do updates through, you know, throughout on the tobacco and the how this all plays out or works out, because this is our first time growing tobacco, first time growing many things. Um, now, some things I've grew before, but not the tobacco. This is first time on it. But, um, hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.